channel. I do hope you're doing well. So we have a winter warmer and it is a winter warmer indeed. I've kind of took some advice from a recipe and then pretty much I'm winging the rest of it. We are doing a steak and Guinness pie. I know a lot of you have been saying, shan't do a pie, shan't do a pie. I am, however, going to be cheating because I'm using ready roll pastry, okay? I'm not faffing around making pastry on a Sunday evening, my lovelies, but we're going to have a nice bit of pie. We're going to have some mashed potatoes. We've got some swede and some savoy cabbage to have with it. So I don't want to rat a tat tat because all of the hops are going to be on, the oven's on. It's going to be a full day. And let's see how much it costs. Because today, with it being Sunday, we have had the heating on, we have had baths. The gas already is at £5.91. Shall we see what it is at the end once we've cooked up, hopefully, a very lovely pie. Oh, and this one, you best believe this one will be helping with the onions. <music> Mum, to stop her sucking on the spoon. Much appreciated, please. So, with this, I think I've just chipped my mouth, yes. Um, everything's pretty much just chucked the veg in. Shallots, mushrooms, peas, carrot, chuck it all in. Very like rustic pie. Let's have a look. Chuck the mushrooms in and then what I do is I like to put the mushrooms in let them get a little bit soft and then add the guineas and then add in your shallots and everything like that I've already got me jug of gravy to go in with crumpled a beef stock cube in there but we need to just put this up on high and let it burn down Dada was just messaged and said it's snowing it does seem to be snowing where we are but snow is on its way pastries at because it's got to settle for like half an hour or something before it goes on we're still undecided about what dish to put it in i'm thinking maybe like the crumble dish mum's thinking nan's dish and i'm also thinking like the mini dishes because of the pastry so hmm. let this reduce well not reduce that but let the mushrooms cook for about five ten minutes and then we can add the beer in and Burn, baby, burn. So we, of course, have original Guinness, which I'm not really, like, a Guinnessy y person, but since we had the brown owl on the last one, I'm quite partial. So, Mum, do you want to try this? No, <laughs> Mum, don't want to try it. So I've just took out the steak and the mushrooms. Let's bring you down and let's see this. Do its thing. Next year. Shining like no other Ooh. I don't want what's wrapped in paper No, I don't long for gifts of gold But I'll be home for you We need to now season it all. 
when we put the gravy in. So with nice thick gravy here. Dunk that in. So we've got one bottle of Guinness, one crumpled up beef stock cube, and one litre of gravy. So now it's just seasoning time. And we like a lot of seasoning. Oh, you're up there. You're putting in there banging around. I'm swimming the bottle. We're going to have some herbs because herbs are a must. We are going to, of course, have some garlic salt. I can't be bothered to do fresh garlic. And then we're going to have some cracked salt and black pepper. And then we're going to be having this with mashed potato. I think we'll probably have plain mash because I don't want to take away the flavour from the pie. And we're going to have some soy cabbage and sweet. Do you want me to start doing the veg? Uh, you can prepare the veg if you want, mother. And then now, that literally will go down for about half an hour and we shall just let it simmer and thicken up. But let's bring you into the seat before the lid goes on. It's got a little horn on it. We're just going to have plain mash today. Yeah, because I think with the pie, I've got the honey mustard relish. Oh, well we can have them maybe if we get some little sausages. Oh. Still trying to decide which trays to have, my lovelies, because I have a feeling there's going to be a lot. Oh, one in the top one. What, to just more side of the meat? The meat? Yeah, because we've got this one sheet of pastry, though, so I'm thinking maybe if you halve it or just do it as a big one. Oh, is that pastry got to cover the, all the stuff? The top. I'll put it in there. So, yeah. You don't have to put it right up because you've got to watch the gravy in there. Yeah. Just. Is it not too shallow? Oh, where was the other? Yeah, is it the round one or the oblong's long? Oh, we've got. They're all quite shallow. The only other thing I was thinking was the. Oh, Nan's over one, I need to. Because it's got a lid on it as well, wouldn't it? Yeah. If you want to put the lid on or you don't, I don't know. I say, I think this is the um, first pie we've actually done on the channel. I think, I can't think, apart from doing like a crumble, whether we done next year, I think we'll do a nice uh, fruit pie, fish pie. Oh, actually, I think I've done a fish pie, not as a recipe, I think maybe like a blog. Maybe we've got our egg to wash over the pastry. The meat is cooking away slowly. So yeah, apparently it's snowing. It looks, I've just looked out the window, it's like a very light dusting. It's nothing major. No, but I can put it straight in the pan, Mum, if you want. No, because you boil the water and then I put it in here. We could put them in there and then pour the boiling water on, so the bowl. Oh, I don't mind. I, for one, would love a bit of snow. I don't know about you. Yeah, I love snow. I'm sure viewers, because normally with Nanny G, she said when it snows, it's milder. Is that true? Yeah. Is that true? Please let us know at home if that is the case. I don't know. I just love a bit of snow. The only difference is when you're an adult now, you don't get like days off work. Yeah. When you used to snow, you'd be like, right, no school today. Like, Woohoo! We did, Down we the did the snow on the didn't we? Yeah. Down the fields on the sleds, the toboggans, the wooden toboggans. Yeah, you don't get that at work. They're just like, okay, we'll just come in a bit later. And you're like, oh, no. Ay, ay, ay. Right. That's got another 10, 15 minutes. And then once that's done, we will come back and we can start to construct the pie. Have you filled the kettle up, mate? 
Uh, it's a little bit empty from the gravy. We'll chop it up. I'm going to put the oven on there. The oven goes on 180, so that'd be nice and heated. Then we can put it on, and we should hopefully have a nice pie. It's not like a proper pie. We're not doing full pie. We're just oh. doing a pie top. Oh. We're doing a cheat pie because I don't really like a lot of pastry, and we've had uh, a lot of food. Well, we could do the cabbage on the street as well, yeah. Yeah, you can do. Oh, nice. And then we could do. Oh, actually, I'll do the cabbage because I like oh. doing. I like the motion of the ocean, but yeah, the sweet definitely not. These are tiny sweets, mate. I to get two now. Guys, look how tiny these sweets are. Where were the days where you used to get the huge ones? The huge, huge ones. What, the sweets? Yeah. I think it just depends what farm it comes from, doesn't it? And we've got that much on the um, hob. We haven't even got a spare ring or saucepan for me mulled wine. Oh. It's gonna have to be a Bailey's kind of night. Make your chocolate Bailey's because I've drunk all of my Bailey's. That's the plan. I'm fine, I can have a little one. <laughs> too bad no it's really good let's <laughs> say so, very different for us we've got shallots in here but show me the pastry it looks beautiful mm, tapping yeah i know it's not homemade i know it's shop bought but hey ho if you can cheat you can cheat eh and i didn't put any extra gravy over like the potatoes and that because i thought we can have the gravy from the um Pie. I say, normally you do a load more gravy, innit? Hmm. 
pastry is actually quite nice. Yeah, it looks at one. How long did the pastry take? Half an hour? 15 minutes? Oh, what then? How many sweets you put on? Just one. Oh. I think sometimes you can like double it up, but I don't like a thick pastry. That's probably why we don't eat pies a lot. Yeah, yeah. So just having a thin topping is good for us. <coughs> Excuse me, Rios. No, it's not. Nice. And I do like putting a bit of ale now in like stews and pies. What did we have last time? Newcastle Brown Ale. Oh yeah, and what have we got today? Stay. Guinness. Oh, Guinness. Guinness oh, stout. Let's try shallot. I, I can't even remember the last time I had a shallot. That's the little onion, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, hmm. They're a bit sweeter than a normal onion. You can eat whole one. It's, it's not whole for taste, is it? I just put a little bit of um, butter in the mash and swede. You know what you could have put in? I don't know if we had it. You could have put some red wine. But is that what you I'm mentioned the other day? Wine. Oh, I could have put in some Worcestershire sauce as well. <gasps> oh, I don't know. Because you mentioned something about red wine the other day, didn't We've got you? to try and get a nice normal red wine so I can right. try the mulled spice bags. Oh, that's it, right. Red. Red. Right, then I'll do that when I go to Mops. Mm. Let us know down below what is a winter pie that you like. Are you more like, say, a chicken pie? Like, I do like a chicken and veg short crust pie from Bird's Eye. Oh, yeah, you like them. I like right? them ones. Did you? How much meat is there a kilo, isn't it? Mm. Like, it's a good packed pie. I don't like a pie that's like tiny. Plenty of herbs. Let's get a bit of the meat, as I say. This should be, if I cooked it right. Mm. Tender as a judge. Mm. Everyone's sending now, like, um, photos of the snow. Oh, right. nine out of ten so we are going to see into most of this so uh prepare to see a time lapse and we will then check in with you after only you and me i'll be making plans make you food demolished i think that went very very nice for shop bought pastry yeah it's nice it was too bad. yeah nice the filling was nice the shallots were nice button mushrooms for a change was very nice well we you've got, you've have got some for work if you want tomorrow and in the meantime while we was eating it snow came down yeah so <laughs> it's 10 to 10 at night we've just been out in the snow <laughs> Mum was very, very excited. I was singing Mariah Carey and Shannon saying, Mum, there's a newborn baby. Opposite the street, Opposite. don't wake up. So um, I think I might actually go into work early tomorrow just to see if we can have snowball fights. Yeah, but you're, you'll obviously, the plows will be out tonight with the gritters, but you'll have to see what the snow's like. Hey ho. But as I say, I will leave. Leave at six, you'll be there for eight. <laughs> I will leave like recipes down below, but I pretty much just winged it and put what I wanted in the pie. Yeah. And it didn't go too bad. So if you did enjoy the video, you know what to do. Hit As um, it said, it cut out again because I've been yakking too much. If you did enjoy the video, guys, hit that thumbs up and subscribe down below. Leave us a comment. What is your favourite winter pie or your favourite winter warmer dish? And what do you do in the snow, viewers? Do you do snow angels? Mum said, should I go doing snow angels? I was like, no, you'll get hypothermia. <laughs> I can't be dealing with that. We, we, to do if with it weren't so late, we could have run out together and had a snowball fight and viewed it, eh? It. Well, that's what I'm worrying about when I'm at work. You're going to have to behave yourself. Actually, you can play around in the garden. There's plenty of snow in the garden for I can't, you. I can't get around the garden out the back door. Oh, yeah. I've got to, I've got to go out, run and squeeze through the skin. <laughs> oh, oh, no. I, I might just go mad and tip the table up. <laughs> she loves a bit of snow. But, yes, as I say, 
There is a snow Those coming times. in the vlogs. I can't remember last time we had a white Christmas. Remember when you were small and me and Dad picked you and George up and we come back here and went me uh, Mary said Doreen and we had snow angels. Um, how old was you then? I was in six, seven. Primary school. Yeah, yeah. The only, last time that I remember snow at Christmas was when we was up north one year because the donkeys on the field opposite. Oh, so that's that's, years that's and when years I had ago. to drive back from uh, the pub, wasn't it? What was it called? That was years and years ago because Granddad yeah. was alive. Yeah. So yeah, uh, the block and tackle, wasn't it? Something like that. Yeah. So uh, yeah, stay tuned for Vlogmas is coming up because there is snow now. When it's did we last have snow? Game. Do you reckon then? I think we when had it was one it? Year in February. Three or four years ago. I remember having it at a log cabin in February when I went away once to Somerset. So that's got to be four years ago. And I remember years ago, February, Valentine's Day, we had snow because I dropped that thing on my foot when I was working, didn't I? I had to go to the hospital with the ice on my foot. But I can't remember it ever no. being in like December. So uh, I think yeah. maybe it was about, say, three, four, five years ago. I don't think it recently, was it? No, I can't remember snow around Christmas time. But I can't ages. believe it's snowing, viewers. And it it's been very cold because you normally get the snow when it's uh, milder. And trust it to snow the week of the Christmas work stew. Well, you won't be able to wear no high heels on. I think you're going to have to yeah. wear a pair of wellies with your dress. I'll, I'll be getting carried into that venue. I'm not, I've waited for this outfit for ages and my plan my outfit. I'm not now not wearing it because of the snow. I might take a jacket though because I might freeze. And you've not been there for two years for the COVID, don't you? So uh, come hell or high water, I'll be getting carried into that venue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but yes, take care. Stay safe as always. And tomorrow, you got a brand new video. I'm what time are we getting up tomorrow? Five. I'll be up a lot earlier than that for work. I might be up oh. about four-ish tomorrow. Oh, well, come we? Because I've got to go out and uh, do the car off with the broom. <laughs> yeah, but that won't be ice. That'll be easy to dust off. No, ho hopefully, if it's, it's like... It's not like frost. Hopefully, if it's like this and it don't come no more, I'll be able to get the broom and just dust it all off. We'll see. So you'll see that in Vlogmas sorting out the cars. Night-night. Night. -night. Night.